What's good, y'all? This is Vital. Um, I had a request to discuss absent fathers. I'm sure there are absent moms, but from experience and from uh, people that I know, they are raising their children by themselves because of the absence of a father. Shout out to all the fathers that stick around, and shout out to the fathers that are single fathers. You get much respect, but there is few of you, and um, not enough. So, uh, here we go. One. You are only a sperm donor if you're not there for your kid. You will always be in their father, genetically, but you will never, ever, ever, ever be a dad. Or daddy. Okay. Number two. What's up with fathers, genetic fathers, that um tattoo their kids' name on their bodies? Is it just for show? It has to be for show because you're not there. I mean, you rather spend money on the ink on your neck or the neck the the ink on your arm or on your legs then uh, pay some child support buy your kids some sneakers buy some school supplies buy them a laptop give the mom some money to feed the kid I mean after all you are the creator well partly the creator um, I guess you just want to show off the ink because you're not really a dad, you're really not a father, you're just a sperm donor. Number two, oh, sorry, that was two. Damn, I'm already in two. Okay, well, I'm in three now. Um, what's up with the fathers that uh claim their kid as just a family member, not a son or a daughter? Oh, they look like me because that's my cousin. Nope, they look like me because that's my brother. That's lame, number one. Number two, if your girl really believes that, she's a fucking lame and a dumbass. And, um, why would you deny your own flesh and blood? Like, I don't get it. You should be proud to be a dad. You know, a lot of people out there want to be parents and they can't because of reproductive problems, financial problems, um, because they're gay and they have to spend a lot of money to actually have kids. And you know what? That's your loss. You know what I mean? Because they're always going to look at their mother and um, celebrate Father's Day with their mom. Because of you. I was raised with that. Um, my mom was a single parent, however, I had a lot of love growing up, I'm very privileged for that. Um, I had a grandma and a mother and family that were there for me. I always had that um, missing component and I remember searching for him and finding him and now I have a relationship with him. But it was a long road, it took like eight years for, us to actually, for me to actually give him a hug um he's in my life now and i'm very appreciative to that however i don't know how to be a daughter to him and he doesn't know how to be a father but we have uh understanding and i do love him and i'm very happy that he's in my life um however you know i still celebrate mothers and fathers day with my mom anyway that is my shout out to uh, you uh, wanna be daddies. I guess you'd rather be a daddy to your uh, girl instead of um, your kids. <laughs> Me. How fucking name are you? And number two, my next thing is I do not believe in abortion. Um. But I'm not going to sit there and um, tell everybody not to have an abortion. I'm just going to tell you how I feel about it. I feel that 
um, abortion can only happen if the person was raped or sexually abused. Um, I believe that uh, abortion is a it. I'm sorry, it is a woman's choice, but I don't believe in that. Like I wouldn't do it. I'm not gonna go and bomb fucking abortion clinics. I'm not gonna do that. But I don't feel like abortion should be a form of birth control. You had an abortion once, you made a mistake. Okay. Abortion twice, three times, four times. You're not only fucking up your body, number one. Number two, you're opening yourself up to having, to getting STDs. HIV is real people. One in five people have it and they don't even fucking know. Who so get tested. Um gynorrhea, everything, you get anything you're having sex without a condom it's, get a, it's a given you're having an abortion, using it as a form of birth control fucking up your body and taking away a life I don't agree with that at all I'm sorry um, you guys are open to telling how you feel about that, I'm totally down to listen um, I'm trying I'm trying not to judge you I want to understand what's going on in your mind, and your perspective, and your life. You know what I mean? But I just feel like abortion should not be done and be like, all right, well, you know what? We can have sex without a condom. I'll just take the morning after pill. No, that shit ain't cute. Stop. Use a fucking condom. Use a condom. Use a condom. Okay. Next topic. The next topic I'm going to re-record because I don't want to upload this shit and wait about 10 minutes for the shit to fucking upload. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a sip of this drink, you're going to watch me, and then I'm going to pause it, and then you're going to read the next, you're going to listen to the next video, right?